splat shack. Error. Furman suction nozzle not attached. This unit is unprepared for specialized eradication procedures. All right, Duck Low. Let's hear that passphrase. That's true. Let's see if this thing works. Or if he set us up for failure. This facility is currently experiencing a heightened security event. Accessing this facility requires voice modulated passphrase. Please speak the passphrase. Here we go. We attest to the zest with our hand on our chest. Be impressed as our guest by what we finessed. You are blessed to ingest what we thoroughly test. You've tried the best. Now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Passphrase accepted. Access granted. Welcome, Dr. Jasper Lowe. Oh my gods, it worked. It worked, Felix. Doc Lowe used to run this place. Made the drug that turned decent folk into marauders. I can't imagine living with that kind of guilt. Well, now you know why he inhales stuff, right? I think deep, deep down inside, Dr. Lowe isn't as hard as he thinks he is. Look for any key cards. Oh, you know what? Be a little meta here for a little bit. I don't think... I don't think that's going to work. I think everyone needs to be close when we're inside. Yeah. See any key cards? Huang. Urgent notification. This urgent notification brought to you by Spacer's Choice Automated Subversive Behavior Notification System. Please be informed that one or more of the following high priority conditions are likely to be active in your office or workplace. One, escape primals. Two, unlawful discussion of subversive cultural material. Three, extended and unauthor unauthorized breaks. Well, yeah, I guess three really belongs with the other two. Please notify your supervisor immediately. If you are the designated supervisor of this workplace, this message can constitutes your official notification of this automated response. Please do not respond directly to this message. Messages. Too low. Corrective messages. Huang, too low. Jasper. Jasper, I've been taking your message out my terminal like you asked. This was for management, though. Please take a look at this. I get trouble for deleting it. Good fellow. Dr. Lowe, I speak for everyone. OCI, disappointment, your work ethic, quality of compound X, harvest it and enrich it. Your laboratory falls well below Spacer's Choice standards. Like they have standards. It is my fresno thing. Quality of one works, reflects the quality of one spirit. Lazy workers deliver lazy work. Round up your researchers. Fire one in ten. Wow. Expect you and your remaining researchers to deliver the next batch. Well, we know what f fire really means. Terminate means terminate. Just like Udom. Measures may seem punitive, even harsh. They are. I am instilling discipline in your team. One day, I like to imagine you'll thank me, respectively. Yeah. Work fortifies. Uh, please respond, Jasper. I know you told me not to bother when you're working, but I'm running out of options. Uh, concerns simple yes and no. Just respond with Y or N. One, did you read Goodfellow's letter? Two, am I on the chopping block? Three, has security talked to you about some type of corporate spy in our ranks? Three, A, is there a spy? Four, did you know Padilla's heart gave out after 72 hours shift? 72 hour? Four, A, are you attending the wake? I got staff coming to the receptions looking for answers. Are you going to respond? N, respectfully, Chess Perlow. Well, there you go. Tanaka, uh, chief, I found a key in a locker by the lavatories. The key belongs to Dr. Lowe. Please retrieve the key and return it to him. I do it myself, but Dr. Lowe can be pretty paranoid. If I show up at his door with a key in hand, he'll assume I stole it in order to fabricate a reason to check up on him. Is there a key here, guys? Is there a key? 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 A key. I don't see one. My geographic scanner's not picking anything up. Sam? No. Okay. Key? That's not a key. 
people never seem to take the hint. Oh, great. What is it about me? You hear that? Good luck. I got the strangest notion that was sarcasm. About wishing us good luck, I mean. I'm pretty sure the threat was real. Unless but we're getting stalked by two different shadowy figures with the same creepy voice, I'm pretty sure this is the same jackass from back in the OCI. Those, those serial dramas uh, have taught you well there, Felix. Yes, I believe it is the same figure. And I believe we're going to have company pretty soon. Well, there's the override authorization. There's the security door. Do you think we can make a run for it? But first, a dapper hat. Oh, I already got this one. Oh, Felix, we should make sure that you put on your gear, please. I don't think I brought your gear. Oh, I'm so sorry, dude. Um, this will have to do. It just doesn't fit you, though. If we find something heavy, I'll be sure to give it to you. Um. Well, that's an elevator. I'm not sure I want to take the elevator. Silent mode, Sam. Muting volume now. Thank you. Oh, no. Time to take out the trap. Unauthorized contaminant. Watch it, Felix. Sam. Sam! That's the last of him! This unit is clean, mean, and ready to kill germs! Sam, you never. Whoa! Oh! Sam! I touched shine! Object is tuned to be backwards! Ha! <laughs> Sam! Putting trash in its rightful place for more than 70 years. You never cease to amaze, Sam. Okay. Uh, there's another one around here. What we're going to do is called perimeter, Felix. Come on. Well, first, before we do that... I think he's still looking for us. Let's go here. Main lab. Oh! Thank you, Sam. Main laboratory messages to Palavi Low. Can we please, Dr. Low? I think we speak for all colleagues. Worried about OCI's treatment facilities. 10% of our. I can understand. You can understand that, huh? I can understand cutting our deadlines in half in order to motivate us. Can you? But, and forgive me, Dr. Low, I can't understand demanding we send human inquiry our untested compounds. 
many are test aren't tested because we know they're failures. And they still did it anyway. The good people at OCI, yeah, good people, understand the complexity of the compound. Will give us time and resource. What do you think? From Jasper, Dr. Pallavi, the OCI are compromised by a gaggle of carrying feeders. You go up there with your markers and your charts and your diagrams and they chew the flesh off your bones and then charge me for the meal. It's absolutely critical that I finish my research a piece and as soon as possible to the interference for the OCI. So in answer to your question, no, we fucking can't. Best Jasper Law. Personal files. Uh, work fortifies the spirit. Uh, good fellow, six weeks or now three weeks. Work fortifies the spirit. Jesus. Guthier enriched compound. They were destroyed in a unplanned sabotage, which is to say Mr. Mosley's fancy tables couldn't predict this would happen. Oh, so his tables couldn't happen. That meant it must have been sabotage. Done and done. So it probably wasn't sabotage. It was just mostly not thinking that his algorithms couldn't be wrong. Ah. Uh. Rosco, it's Georgie. If you're hearing this, you must still be holed up at the Sprat Shack. And you're not gonna like this one bit. I was trying to steal our recordings when things went crazy. I know, I know. Like I said, sorry. And I'm gonna be in a heap of trouble if I don't get them, so if you wanna save my bacon, you need to do it for me. I need the three interviews we did with Ambrose, this one here, plus another recording of my own. I left that last one with a guy who owed me a favor at the garbage processing office in the chemical waste ravine. I'll leave an automech near Stellar Freighting. It'll want all five recordings, plus a passphrase. Glacial age. Oh, and don't listen to my log, all right? Just, just stay safe and keep your head down. Oh, well, you know what? If I, if I actually put on my lock picking outfit. Wow, how did you do that? Well, special gear, I suppose. But I put on my freaking hacking gear. Freaking, I don't know. All right. Sam. Truly are an immovable object, my man. Run diagnostics, not found. Research data, corrupt it, not found. Open last entry, who may concerned. Warning, I and my colleagues got in the reception hall. Tenth staff member was released. I am one of them. Our gamma, I have served for most of my life. Gorgon is highlight. Because my contract guaranteed my work. To end that contract is tantamount to ending my life. This job is all I have. Please allow... Me to fortify my spirit by continuing to work. Z G Zhang. Jesus. Research. Dr. Lowe, I'm afraid I don't know what your research notes are. Searched them all. Nothing came up. Venture down there, but you know how I feel about primals. Apologize for the weakness. My constitution. I'll find a better, safer version of eight. Well, Lowe was trying to find a safer version, huh? But... Jesus. You know, I'm not exactly sure if everyone here is evil or if they're so blinded. I'm going to guess the latter. Keycard? No. Well, they wiped out all the chemicals here. So we're not going to find anything. Sam! Out of my way! One order of 
American fan coming up. Felix, when I say Sam, I mean Sam, not you. Customer, your Sam unit is performing at peak capacity. You always are, Sam. Felix, when I say Sam, I mean Sam. I know you're all gun ho. You want to fight some good fight, but Sam is here for a reason. Oh, for crying out loud. Guess what's down there, fellas? Should we? Hello. Here I come. Felix, I didn't even say anything yet. You all right? That's my bones. Oh, that poor schmuck. Oh, universe, why do you tease me so? You'd think there would be something up there, wouldn't you? Maybe I think I'm playing a video game. You guys don't know what that is. You know, when we walked into the lab, I thought, what's the worst thing we could run into? Of course, the answer had to be primals. That is very true. Watch out! Cleaning cycle complete. Good job. Oh, guys. I got beat up a little bit, but I'm okay. Jesus. LELAX and free. That's it. Search of anything out of you for use, guys. No. No shoot, boss. Try another weapon. That works just fine, Felix. No. Oh my god, what were they doing? Were they feeding primals, these people? Or did the primals just, after a while, go after them? And were they marauders, or were they... Or were they the remaining scientists? Well, the one good thing is the Primals took care of most of these sentries. But of course, there has to be more. On it, boss! Take 
Get up, Felix. Get up. Sam? Sam? Come on, buddy. You alright, Felix? Got knocked down. Just scratched a bit, huh? Okay. You okay, Sam? Everything working in there? Okay. It looks like you got a smiley face with two eyes, by the way. I wonder if they did that on purpose. Do you hear what I hear? Do, 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 do. I hear some primals. Must be Doc Lowe's old office. I do believe you're right. Night falls on Gorgon. Though I suppose it's always dark here in the void. The lab is empty, and I am at last alone. I'm preoccupied with thoughts of the single-celled xenocytes that make their home here on this rock. These primordial creatures persist despite the hostility of their surroundings. No. They require adversity to thrive. Perhaps that's why our bodies react to their... Are we being stalked? Is that what's going on? Because I don't mind having secret admirers and all, but this is getting a little creepy. Just a little? Master of the understatement, Felix. Now, where was I here? Great. It's one of these, I know it. Night falls on Gorgon, though I suppose it's always dark here in the void. The lab is empty, and I am at last alone. I'm preoccupied with thoughts of the single-celled xenocytes that make their home here on this rock. These primordial creatures persist despite the hostility of their surroundings. No, they require adversity to thrive. Perhaps that's why our bodies react to theirs. There is a harmony in us. The law didn't craft us for the void, yet we scrabble across its cold worlds, building, persisting, as the xenocytes do. We live. Against all odds, we live. But for how long? Looks like Olivia was having a little bit too much uh, purple berry wine that day. Messages. Incoming. Uh, blah, blah. Lab personnel. Don't speak to the journalist. That's from Olivia. Um, volunteer. Marion sent over. The current, you were right. The current formulation is resulting in alarming outcomes. I wonder if she was getting a conscience. It seemed she was. 11 consecutive days of wakefulness. Oh my gosh, she was no sting of her violent hallucinations. A young man in his early 20s. Gray matter loss wouldn't expect to see a man in 70. His brain also atrophied to a shocking extent again in a much older man. Good lord. Violence aside, I'm growing increasingly concerned by the habit forming nature of the compound. Materials we, are, we work with are dangerous. Permanent injury. Priyantha LeBlanc for monthly physicals and psychiatrics. 
Well, she was doing something right, right? Outgoing. Dr. Ambrose. These days I try to think as little as possible. Thinking is a dreadful habit which leads to self-awareness, which leads to resignation. If there's anything that Jasper Lowe said that sums everything up and what he, he's going through, it's that. Current formulation is resulting in alarming outcomes. But not, I think, by SC standards. The SC standards are low. You report 11 consecutive days of wakefulness. And they see productivity. You report an inability to distinguish violent hallucinations. SC is going to try to push us to turn those hallucinations into phantom images of company logos. You say the compound is habit forming and Spacer's Choice is going to see an increase in demand for our never ending supply of xenocyte waste. To be serious, yes, the compound is absolutely habit forming. Addiction correlates with doses and doses size is inversely proportional to enrichment quality. As long as corporate asks us to keep our doses minimum, Minimal and controlled, there's a reasonable chance we can improve the enrichment process to filter out some of the dangerous side effects. It's going to take time, a lot more time than corporate realizes. Executive lockdown. Halcyon's got no shortage of creepy science labs, boss. But this place... There's something real twisted about this place. I'm sure no one meant for this to happen, you know? Spacer's choice ain't in the business of helping people. Maybe they didn't mean to create the Marauders, but I don't think they were trying to make the colony a better place. I know it ain't saying much, being Spacer's choice and all, but Doc Lowe and his team was their best and brightest. How could this happen? They were pushed to do the impossible by people who weren't accountable. How most evil happens, Felix. Yeah, well, maybe they should have pushed back. Maybe they should have said no. I don't know if anybody's going to take the fall for what happened here. It could be Miss Ambrose if she's not careful. Now let's get to that journal before we jump to any conclusions, okay? What do you think, Sam? Good work. Thank you, customer. Sam, we guarantee you it's the only sanitation and maintenance unit you'll ever need. Darn it. Just me, or am I walking a little fast? I am. Damn it. Jasper's storage key. Guys, look for a key. Hmm. Could have been up the stairs. Oh, guys. We all in one piece? Yeah, I think so.
Come out. No, this is just the exit. Let's get out of here. I think I got primal guts all over my ass kicking boots. Well, we're not getting out of here yet, Felix. Gotta find that key. Felix, try this. Let's enlighten me for a second. Okay. Sounds so close. I think they're all down. You gotta show me how you did that. Yeah, but I think I found something even better for you here. There you go. Somebody was just dumping these all over the place. I gotta. I just gotta change. Don't look at me. Why did I keep all. God, I look grotesque.
well, well, well. I might, I do say, Felix, this makes me feel badass. Ah, I think we found something for you, Felix. There you go. Actually, still wear that. Whoa! That would have hurt. Security, access restrictions. Oh, well, there you go. Well, we kill them all, so it doesn't matter. Can't explain. Primals defy. Tanaka. Following with transfer. Maybe Tanaka actually got out of here. Alright, my little primal. I hear you puffing. We'll come and see you soon. Is that it? Staying out of sight. Well, that's just... the key be down here? Dunlop critical update. Your production quota is raised by 200% bi-weekly. Last entry. Damage, damage, disposed. Woke up, fell asleep at table. Toxic... Uh, disposed. And just telling us what we already know, right? Oh. Whoa. Invasive Whoa. Detected. Scrubbing the dirt out. What the fuck? So much for... All germs and contaminants have been neutralized. Ah, damn it. Always with this corrosive crap. of Compound X are inescapable. The uh, refined excrement of the Xenocyte life form. It's a fine powder, very fine. It finds its way into absolutely everything, even in the water now and the air. It settles like a veil over all of Gorgon. The laboratory techs get the worst of it. We all appreciated the boost to mood and productivity at first, but we're at each other's throats in an instant now. I've had to break up two fistfights this week alone. This aggression must be inherent to the formula, to Compound X. How do I stop Dr. it? Dr. Lowe and his people didn't just work here. They lived here. This lab must have been their whole life. It's nothing.
You wouldn't think these marauders would have it, do you? Let's check the lockers. How the devil do I use this thing? Is it what? Oh, the barrel's turning. All right. <clears throat> I feel like an absolute idiot barking into this horn. I shouldn't have let Lucian talk me into this. What use do I have with audible notes? Posterity, my ass. Ah, great fucking law. What's it doing now? Jasper! Jasper, it's... How do I turn it off? We got it. It won't. Just press the button. The what? Oh, for law's sake, the button, Ollie. Accursed thing. An alleged genius who couldn't work a recorder. Okay. Oh, this one. Shrank themselves before putting a hole in their head. Another pleasant day here on Gorgon. All right, so we got what we, we need, guys. Let's go. I don't even know what we're going to find down there, so be careful. What would be down there? Here we go. Has there ever been an experiment involving primals that wasn't a total catastrophe? No. Wash mode on. Hands out. Uh, watch it. Job classification. Flawlessly finished. Good going, Sam. Look for any notes, passwords, maybe. Maybe we can find a cure. Maybe. I don't see anything. <laughs> ah, of course not. the hell is this thing? Oh, here we go. Research notes. Initial research into primal neurochemistry has proven fruitful. Cardiac cell receptor for adrenaline and inoculus to human cell receptors in function. If not in physiology, it should be possible to develop a pharmaceutical blocks the effect of the adrenaline hormone in primals curtailing their paranoia, agitation, and violent irritability. It is possible, but unlikely, given the way OCI is going to be thumbscrews. Adrenal time is a dangerous drug. It can be mitigated by developing an adrenaline inhibitor. Take adrenal time, then take this theoretical drug to minimize its side effects. I barely have the time, energy, or resources to develop. I have passable adrenal time, so this idea must remain a dream. Nonetheless, my notes follow. Hope springs internal. You know what? See, I... You know what? I, I knew there was something about Jasper that there was something there. There was something there. And I think... And I think... There was something there with Olivia. But I don't think she survived. Jasper survived. And Minnie's alive, so maybe... We send this to Minnie... And she could do what her... She has mommy issues, so maybe she could do what her mom couldn't do. Right? Right? Yeah, boss? She could... Minnie could create a cure and, you know, get back at her mother at the same time. And we could use that. 
we could use her mommy issues to state uh, to state it would be a good motive, right? So what else? What do you think? When we took this job, I thought we were living out an adventure serial. But after what we saw in those labs, I don't feel like much of a hero anymore. Hey, you doing all right? I can't stop thinking about that human testing facility. Hmm. Even saying that out loud makes me sick to my stomach. I keep imagining what it must have been like. Locked up cages, pumped full of drugs. After they died, Spacer's Choice just processed their bodies and tossed them out with the garbage. Boss, I've seen animals at a slaughterhouse treated with more dignity than those people. Yeah. I feel the same way. I always figured Spacer's Choice was no different from Anticleo or Brizzo or Hammersmith. They're all cogs in the same corporate machine grinding this colony down to dust. What we saw back there wasn't just corporate greed. It was pure evil. Project Gorgon is in the past. There's nothing we can do. There's plenty we could do. Tear down Byzantium, dismantle the board, round up everybody in Spacer's Choice, and toss them out on airlock. Look, never mind. I just need some time to sort all this out. Thanks for listening, boss. Listen, Felix, it just means that there's something in you that they can't sully. You've got a good heart and a good nature. Sometimes that just happens in people. It's even without the nurturing. That makes you a good person, Felix. That makes you a guy that's going to make a difference, okay? Hey, what about those freeboaters trying to board our ship, huh? Somebody out there wants us dead. That don't exactly narrow the field. Whoever it was, if they really wanted to cross us off, they should have sent competent mercenaries. Hmm. Competent mercenaries in this colony? I like your optimism, Felix. Yeah, you're right. Besides, even if the freebooters were competent, you would have made them look like a bunch of amateurs, boss. <laughs> well, I'll find whoever, whoever hired them. And then I'll hurt them in fun and very interesting ways. I'm guessing whoever hired him had something to do with Project Gorgon. Yeah. Mr. Mysterious Voice. Ah, Jesus, Sam! All right. Now, Felix, now you can say we can get out of here. Because we got a date with corporate. This is where we start tearing down Byzantium, Felix.